All right, back to our top story, Boise Downtown Development. Denny Hawkins shows us the plan to build townhomes in an area with a history of crime and why the developer isn't worried about the past. As the heart of downtown Boise starts to fill out, developers are looking at the bigger picture, eyeing opportunities beyond the downtown core. The west end of downtown uh, is eventually going to be the best opportunity for uh, development uh, close into the city. David Hale knows this area well. He developed several buildings in the Linen District and now wants to add a little residential flavor to the neighborhood. I've been driving by this site for uh, a very long time. It just took him years to figure out what he wanted to do with it. Hale plans to transform this empty lot into a space for 15 townhomes, each with two bedrooms and two baths. But some question the development's location. Boise's West End has seen its fair share of crime. Just a few yards from this development is the Cabana Inn. Police say two years ago, a woman was murdered in her hotel room. And just a few blocks away, two men were stabbed back in October here at the Torch. Some say they'd be a little nervous to move into the West End. Courtney King says she moved out of the area to be somewhere with a more residential feel. The only problem maybe was a lack of activity on the streets that sometimes made it feel uncomfortable late at night. But Hale says he's familiar with this area and that the benefits outweigh any of his concern. I don't view it as being, um, you know, detrimental to to the buyers or those that are going to be living in these units. He says he hopes the Idaho townhomes will be an addition that helps the area start to blossom.